Once again, we are back on Eight Moon Search Ki Tea Talk Train of Thought. In each and every episode, we try and ensure we bring the prominent personality on this Tea Talk show, so they can share their experience, and from that, a target audience can draw and meaningful learning. We try and touch upon all the relevant social issues which are there in the society. Apart from that, we talk in terms of leadership, entrepreneurship, young achiever, and diversified stories we cover on our Tea Talk uh, platform. And today, on our Tea Talk platform, platform uh, will be uh, Geeta Podwa. She is a former government officer, anchor, actress, social entrepreneur, founder, and the managing trustee. Of an NGO, Drishya Shakti, and in fact, if we'll see, like when we talk in terms of the culture and the tradition of India, he is considered as a old and great all over the world, where the people used to worship various female goddesses, saints, and poet. India is also a powerful nation and famous worldwide for being the largest democracy in the world. However, the woman backwardness. is also very clear in an indian society because of its social issues the problem and there is a lot of restriction which are there as far as the women which are concerned has the indian mentality really changed that's the reason we are having this kind of an episode this episode to just bring in more clarity and share the experience of an geeta podwal on this tea talk uh, channel we talk in terms of women and the at the corporate place what kind of challenges do they face we talk in terms of an employee security which is there we talk in terms of an sexual harassment in workplace uh, there is a lack of an support from an immediate uh, superiors who are there and there is an lack of an support from the family also and there is an insufficient maternity leave above all like it's basically we look as a woman that they are supposed to look as far as a household work which are concerned but today's woman she is totally different i think the things have changed but again there is some restriction in some part of our society which needs to be uh, uh, which needs to be taken care uh, in fact uh, uh, a small introduction again i would like to give about geeta podwa she is a former government officer the anchor the actress the social entrepreneur founder and the managing trustee of an ngo drishya drivya shakti she is a motivational speaker she is a mentor and the counselor such a diversity like and in fact for 22 years she had worked in and government uh, as a government officer and at each and every phase she had she had gone with an uh, regular promotions which are there but again like while being a part of an uh, government officer what kind of a challenges she had faced i think will be discussed on this tea talk platform and switching the gear from being 22 years in the corporate to being an anchor being an actress being a motivational speaker being a mentor being a counselor is an interesting story for a tea talk audience i'm sure the inspiration what we are going to get by listening to geeta podwal it's going to really change the mindset as far as indian women are concerned that's the reason we are saying that today topic is a we is an iron lady of an india that's geeta podwal why we are saying iron lady of an india because for 22 or 22 years she had worked at the corporate level and she had uh, uh, she has also been a part as a government officer involved in the high profile audit as a all india project tiger audit or uh, leading to the many reforms in the sector and also the audit what she has done uh, for about the prestige institutes uh, department of atomic energy sidat and many other it's a very interesting story is a great diversity which do exist the only a tough woman a tough mindset uh, can navigate through there we are back on ekmun sochi t talk train of thought with a series of an episode with an iron lady of an india geeta podwal i have we have seen uh, the basic basic introduction of her the great diversity for 22 years being in the corporate then now uh, as an anchor actress social entrepreneur founder and the managing trustee of ngo and as a motivational speaker mentor and the counselor Ma'am, welcome to Tea Talk. Ek bun soch ki. Thank you so much. Thanks a lot for sparing your valuable time. Thank you. And uh, we have gone through your profile. It's so interesting. I'm sure it's going to inspire lot many Tea Talk audience out over there. 
Now for the benefit of an audience, I would like to request you if you can uh, share something right from childhood till the first job like with that. Uh, first of all, let me thank Dr. Chima for uh, uh, giving me this platform to uh, share uh, share my story. Yes, uh, first and foremost, uh, I am just a girl next door, and uh, uh, like I in this whole process of living, uh, what happens is that one never knows that uh, we are actually creating a footprint as we walk in our life. Mm -hmm. We go forward. Uh, the same is uh, in my case also. Uh, when I was uh, I was born in Ahmedabad, mm -hmm. Gujarat. Mm -hmm. uh, my parents are uh, ha settled over there. Mm -hmm. uh, I uh, took birth in a middle class family mm -hmm. and uh, a small house, a small brother, mm -hmm. uh, a four a family of four nuclear family. Yeah, yeah. Uh, of course, uh, there were a lot of financial challenges, mm -hmm. lot of problems, lot of issues. But then, like every parent, even my parents aspired that uh, they want their children to study in best of schools. Mm -hmm. So they put me in a very good school, mm -hmm. um, a school which is very well known in Ahmedabad, mm -hmm. GLS, uh, mm -hmm. Gujarat Law Society. Mm -hmm. um, what happened is that that school was basically uh, comprising more of uh, students who were upper middle class or very rich, mm -hmm. and what what used to happen i still remember that uh, when i used to study in school when we used to have uh, wednesdays as a free dress day mm -hmm. and uh, uh, i used to wear the same dress every time mm -hmm. uh, most of most of the wednesdays it used to be the same dress and i used to uh, be isolated by the students many mm -hmm. of uh, our audience would have faced the same mm -hmm. now what happens is that this can definitely demotivate one and uh, push oneself into a corner into a shell and what happens is that it is that shell that when they grow up they do not uh, come out of it and it yeah. damages the personality yeah. now it is either a do or die situation mm. even right at that stage if at mm. that stage you do not get the right counseling mm. right support it damages your entire mm -hmm. life but by god's grace um, i uh, was my own mot motivator mm -hmm. uh, i wanted to do something in life mm -hmm. and that is the reason why i did not allow my education to be uh, mm -hmm. compromised there were financial challenges i used to take tuitions mm -hmm. um, i loved of dancing i'm a classical dancer as well oh, i'm a bharatnatyam dancer uh -huh. uh, i used to teach children and uh, whatever money i used to get from taking tuitions mm -hmm. uh, i used to put that into my own education so mm -hmm. that i do not put it put a burden on to my family, parents yes. uh, i want to narrate an incident over here mm -hmm. sure. um, i remember that I, I used to see on the notice boards uh, competitions uh, speech competition mm -hmm. elocution competition mm -hmm. and i I always used to see that what is the price. Mm -hmm. So if the price is say hundred rupees to that time hundred rupees two hundred rupees yeah, was very matters uh, mattered. So if I used to see hundred two hundred rupees, then only I used to participate. I see. The reason is that that money was important Correct. for me. Uh, if it was trophy or or, or or some medal or something, I was not interested. I see. So. I went up on the stage. It was such a scary experience, mm. and uh, I'll come to that uh, maybe uh, later on. But mm. yes, this is how I used to push myself in life, right. so that I can get myself uh, educated. Mm -hmm. I cleared my graduation mm -hmm. um, from Ahmedabad itself. Um, I uh, I'm a BCom graduate, mm -hmm. and um, till my education was over, it was like. Uh, uh, a, a, a girl who is inside a small shell, oh, I uh, very shy. Mm -hmm. I was extremely shy, which I, which nobody would believe. That I am the same person mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. that I am today. Okay. Uh, very shy, very nervous, very uh, tough to face people. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, when I used to get onto the stage, I used to uh, blast it. I mean, I was mm -hmm. a speech uh, competition winner. Mm -hmm. I was a university champion uh, mm -hmm. in spe public mm -hmm. speaking. Mm -hmm. So that was the whole journey as far as education. No, in That's fact, uh, many a times uh, as a kids, like, you know, uh, we get nervous, like, you know, and we always look in uh, terms of some of a mentor who can guide us through our journey and everything. And uh, as a birth natim is concerned, how, how did interest came like? How you to dance you dance? How you went to God did that? Actually, I was little. Mm -hmm. uh, my my parents used to say that uh, when my father's friends used to come to house, mm -hmm. they used to tell Gita jara dance karke dekhao and I used to be ready like this. 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 ऐसे मेरे पेरेंट्स को पता चला कि आई लव क्लासिकल डांस और आई लव डांसिंग माय फादर 
is very much interested in art. My mother is totally not interested in arts, but my father was very interested in arts. Uh. So he uh, pushed me into it. He got uh, got me to learn dance from one of the best teachers mm-hmm. in Ahmedabad, uh, yes. uh, Bhaskar Mehen Radha Bas Dev Saitya Kala mm-hmm. Academy Award mm-hmm. winners, mm-hmm. and I I I could uh, learn dance from them. I want to tell you one more important thing here. My teachers had come home to tell my parents that uh, don't let Geeta stop learning dance. Let her go at a higher level. She she will be one of the top dancers in the country. Mm-hmm. But what happens is that the traditional mindsets Correct. that uh, no, she has to do a job. Mm-hmm. She has to work. She cannot go into dance. Mm-hmm. Uh, a dancer is not a very good profession. Correct. So that Correct. kind of a ma- mindset, mindset that that is, is there in the mm-hmm. country. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's the reason why I could not. Otherwise, today I would have been in a totally different. आई थिंक कई बार अब भी हमारे समाज में देर इज अ ट्रेडिशनल माइंड सेट विच दे फील लाइक आई थिंक द गर्ल चाइल्ड शुड नॉट डू दिस शी शुड नॉट डू डैट दे इज अ लॉट ऑफ रिस्ट्रिक्शन विच आर देयर एंड वी ऑल्सो वी आर डिपेंडेंट वी वॉक विद क्रचिस वी आर डिपेंडेंट ऑन दी अदर्स टू एंश्योर दैट दे हेल्प अस आउट बट हेयर इज अ इंटरेस्टिंग स्टोरी वट वी आर गेटिंग फ्रॉम गीता पोटवा लाइक बेसिकली शी इज एन सेल्फ लर्नर she took initiative on on her own like you know to be part of an competition and uh, face those kind of an competition probably i think she was facing for a monetary aspects because that can help her education which are concerned and i'm sure we started with a great insight from uh, uh geeta padwa like she had uh, how she had initiated on her own and helping her uh, family and also supporting her own studies i think it's a great insights we started with a real uh, great foundation to what we have laid down on uh, this great story of an geeta padwa i'm sure just stay tuned to uh, t talk ek moon soch ki uh, for a next episode with uh, an iron lady of an india geeta padwa till then go to www.ttalk.net subscribe and like the channel as much as you can ma'am thanks a lot for being part of this show thank, thank you, you very so much, much.